What's poppin' YouTube? It's Tita the Toucan Sam. And I am here today to inform y'all about my MEPS experience. Y'all cannot believe I took off work four times to go to MEPS. Four times. And I went down there three times until I actually got to enlist. And then the third time, G, I was so close not enlisting, G. Because from the last month to... Two two weeks, she guess how many pounds I gained. Guess how many pounds I gained. I don't even really supposed to be in the United States. G. I gained twelve pounds from like this month to this month, G. But I know exactly what I was doing. I ain't always getting all that weight for real, for real. Like I could see it in my face and my stomach. But, G, I ain't know. All right, so let's get right to it. Okay, the hotel, I actually have uh, a little footage in there. So, what y'all are, are about to see is, uh, you know, probably the hotel room. If y'all in Chicago, y'all gonna be staying at the Rosemont. And it didn't make it no better that my sergeant told me about the Kaniga Jenkins. Like, I was... First of all, my major criminal justice, and I was, like, so, so, like, into that case, like, with all the conspiracy theories and everything, but R.I.P. to Kaniga. Uh, but, yeah, the same hotel that she was murdered in. All right, uh, so, you, so I'm going to show y'all that, uh, and you're also going to see where y'all going to be, like, kicking it at with people that's about to go on the same career path as you. So you'll see that uh so that room is gonna be some video game stuff like that. Alright, so go to bed. Woman on one floor, men on the other floor, separate floors. They gonna tell y'all. First of all, my first time there, I missed a whole briefing. So I didn't know I wasn't supposed to do this, 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 that, that. They they give you a whole little lecture on that. You watch a video. Alright, so this is my experience. First of all, my recruiter did not tell me anything. Anything. So, I don't know why my dumb ass, the first time I went, I took a shower at home and went to the hotel. We was actually going real late at night. But, uh, I could have just took a shower at the hotel. Y'all, take a shower at the hotel, G. Um, they didn't feed me. We got that real late. And he said they was going to feed me, but they didn't. But y'all will be eating. Well, if you were in Chicago, you're going to be eating at the, uh, Chicago Fire Grill. Fat food. Really good food. Free food for, for y'all. So, the next morning, y'all going to get up early like probably like be downstairs by 4 30 oh 4 30 come down go to the lounge about to go to the bus y'all do not be afraid of like the bus driver or the people when you get to maps because they gonna act like some assholes they're gonna be cursing and yelling at you like you already in basic training don't be afraid of them at all so when you go to maps Make sure you don't have no jewelry on. Don't bring no contraband. And bring all your uh, documents that you need. Y'all, get some rest. It's going to be a lot of papers, forms, a lot of lines you're going to be standing in. Medical. Y'all, medical is a whole different devil, G. That is the reason why I went back like three times. Damn, there was supposed to be four, but three times, y'all. Y'all recruiters are going to tell y'all to do this, do that, do that. They going to get there and tell you, if you lie to us, you're going to be in jail. Hey, do whatever you want to do. I'm not influencing y'all to do nothing. Just don't go to jail. That's all I'm saying. Don't put yourself in the position that you'll go to jail. All right, so the first thing y'all probably going to do, sit through a meeting. Sit through this long briefing from the commander of MEPS. I'm not going to lie, y'all. I fell asleep. I was dozing off. That's how boring it was. But I was tired, so get some rest. All right, y'all. Let me tell you something. Ladies, my recruiter was a male. He did not tell me nothing. This is what you're going to be doing for medical. Y'all, he did not tell me anything. He just told me, okay, wear a regular bra and panties. Ladies. You're going to be in front of other women. Damn near naked. So do what you got to do. All he told me he was going to be doing a dog walk. Nah, y'all going to be doing all type of stretches y'all never even heard of. Walking on your toes, walking on your heels, um, getting up and then dropping on your knees. Gee, when she told me that, 
I'm it. Of course, it's going to hurt. You making me fall to my knees on this concrete floor. Like, all right. Now, ladies, my, my, my recruiter, he didn't tell me all these different things. And, yo, he did not tell me that they was going to lay you down, open your legs and damn near open you up for a pap smear, looking, looking there, looking your booty and stuff. He did not tell me that. He did not tell me that. So, you know what I did? Hey, I'll get on uh, room service. Hey, room service, can you uh, bring me up uh, shaving cream and a razor, G? First of all, I don't shave. I've been stopped shaving. Uh, I like waxes, but I had to do what I had to do. Get the little bikini line area. G, I, I thought I was going to be good at the bikini line area, but guess what? I should have went all out because that doctor opened me up. Opened me up, y'all. And looked at my boot. <sighs> I was embarrassed. <laughs> I was embarrassed, y'all. So, ladies, hey, make sure everything clean down there. Make sure you're fresh because there's going to be people looking at your twat. The twat and, the, you know, your hoes, G. Do that. All right. Now, back to my story. I had got sidetracked. Um, guys, make sure you can bend. I uh, I know this guy. He couldn't bend. And he, he was disqualified because he couldn't do it. All right. So, uh... Yeah, I went three times. So after that, you're gonna uh take a a test. You're gonna they're gonna make you blow. First of all, I'm horrible at blowing. First of all, I don't smoke, I don't do any of that stuff. But I couldn't hold my 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 breath long enough to like get the little uh screening thing. Cause you have to blow, they have to make sure you're not intoxicated before you send all this uh paperwork. So it took me like eight times to blow. If you know me, y'all know I'm not blowing nothing. G like, I couldn't hold my, I couldn't hold my breath that long. But uh, after that, get your ass is checked. Oh, uh, what else? Yo, they gonna feed y'all, y'all. It's not gonna be no MRAs, MRIs, whatever. Uh, no packaged lunches that you're gonna be eating probably when you out in the field. I'm gonna show y'all an MRI that I found in the bathroom one weekend at drill so i'm about to show y'all that i'm gonna insert it i'll just put it right over there they're gonna give you this dry sandwich G, just dry sandwich some good chips some good cookies and a water and a fruit if you wish yo i will not lie to you y'all check out this next clip what i found in my sandwich check y'all sandwiches before y'all eat it to be honest i did check my sandwich before i ate it but I think it was in the lettuce. The bug was in the lettuce. But hey, y'all. And after that, you feel me? It's going to be uh, inductions every like every hour on the hour. But when I say inductions, I mean enlistments. People are going to be swore in every hour. You probably even see people that's shipping off to boot camp and their families are there. It's such a sad thing, y'all. Like, I be wanting to quiet, cry. I'm real sentimental and emotional. And that stuff, it saddens me because, like, you know, one day... One day, y'all, my cat just tried to do what my dog did, and it was humping this bear. One day, it would be me. One day, it would be my family watching me. One day, it could be you and your family. It's just, it's really emotional, but it's a, it's a great, it's a, it's, it, it's gonna be a great experience, hopefully. Okay, y'all, what else about my MAPS experience? All right, let me tell y'all why I got disqualified. One, I told them my allergy. My allergy disqualified me. Boop, back, couldn't join. Gotta get a waiver. All right, y'all, second time my waiver came. They said it came. They said it came. I go up the wait. That's the only thing. My, my waiver's right there. All I had to do, swear in, you feel me? I stayed up there. I went to the hotel uh, the night before. I stayed there. Oh, the breakfast is good, too. I stayed there. 5 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. Y'all. Doing nothing. You can't... You can be on your cell phone, but you can't, like... You can't go to sleep. And I was just so tired. And I do that at work. You feel me? I If I wanted to get paid from sitting there and doing anything I wanted to do, I would be at work. I would be at work. That's honest. So, I was just frustrated that I didn't enlist that day and I could have been making money. When you take me away from my money, it's a problem. Alright, third time. Okay, he promised me everything was good. Send it in, my waiver, Monday morning. I supposed to go on Friday. Call me Thursday. 
Toucan. Yeah, uh, it's not looking good. Okay, whatever, boom. Next time. Hey, this is my fourth time taking our work, so guess what? I'm about, we finna get to this. We about to enlist, you feel me? It's been a long road. They get me in now. My bestie come up. She see me. I get sworn in. I'll put a picture of it right there. And then a picture of me by myself right there. <sighs> yeah. So I am officially a member of the Army National Guard. My next video will be what to expect and how my experience was my first drill weekend. Stay tuned, you guys. Come on this journey with me. We gonna get swole together. Oh, I continue to embarrass myself. Thank y'all for watching. Give this video a thumbs up. I should have told y'all to bend. Give this video a thumbs up. But it's okay. Give this video a thumbs up. If y'all have any questions about MEPS, anything whatsoever, comment down below. Um, If you have any personal questions, you want to snap me, go add me on Snap. It's do it underscore like Sam. Follow me on Instagram. It's do it underscore like Sam. Everything is doing underscore like Sam. Because it's to the two can Sam, y'all. And I'm out. Peace.